Hello, welcome back guys. I do hope everyone is doing okay and feeling really well and um, thank you for clicking, I do appreciate it. Whether you are new or old, I am very grateful. Today, I am filming a Bratz doll haul. I know, another one. I love, 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 love Bratz dolls. We all know it, girl. I mean, come on, come on. It's me and I can't stop buying them, so what can we do? Uh, um, all right, so I'm gonna be honest, okay? Basically, I have just deleted 49, yes, 49 failed attempts at my intro and I'm like, oh my God. Like, if I could tell you guys how long that took me to film that very short, very simple intro, you would all be like, are you okay? Like, what? Sometimes I can't get like back into the swing of it, but it has been a little while for me me, even though for you guys it might not seem like that long because I uploaded in the middle of like me being ill and I am still ill but I can't go any longer without any content on my channel it saddens me so I can't do it and I wanted to chat to you guys and show you my new dolls because we have a Bratz doll haul my favorite videos to film hands down I absolutely love doing these for you and the interaction with you guys is like phenomenal thank you all so much for the love the support like I appreciate appreciate you all like so much. It's unreal. So yes, if you want to see me show you some new dolls that I got, then stick around and I will dive in right about now. All right, so if you guys watch me on a regular basis, don't worry if you don't, but um, if you do, then you might remember this Bratz Big Baby Sheridan doll, and um, I got her a while ago. Now, basically what happened was, I got her from a charity shop, and she had no outfit barring this, like, you know, Build-A-Bear top, which I wasn't going to keep on her anyway. So it was a bit like, I need to get her some clothes. So I went onto eBay, and like, the fashion packs for the um, Bratz Big Babies are like 27 pounds, and I I was like, um, no, maybe, maybe not, because, I mean, I'm not paying that for clothes, like, no. One pack, one pack of clothes, I'm sorry, but I'm not. So, basically, I put it off and I thought, right, I'll wait till I see, like, a bargain, and then I will get her some clothes and then make her over. Now, I came across a bundle, well, two items in, like, you know, a listing on eBay, and, um, oddly enough, it happened to be another baby Sheridan in her complete outfit, barring her, like, you know, furry coat thing. So, kind of complete, kind of not. You get it. You know what I mean? Then I also seen an in-box, yes, an in-box, like, you know, um, Bratz Big Babies fashion pack. So I was like, that is mine. It is sold. Um, I believe it came to around £17. I've had this now for a while, so I can't remember, but yeah, around £17. So the fashion pack I got was the Bratz Big Babies Pretty and Punk fashion pack. Now I had to get it because how cute is this? Like, I love it so much. And you get the black leather jacket with the black sunglasses. Then you get the jean dress with the English England flag on I believe. I should know because I am born in the UK girl like that's bad. Then you get this red and black like tartan leather handbag which is like very cute very adorable. I want you guys to let me know down in the comments if you want me to do a transformation video on this baby so like you know dressing her up in the fashion pack and doing her hair and stuff so I have had like an idea about doing it but you guys let me know. This is the Forever Diamonds Big Baby Sheridan and I am so happy to have another one in my collection. She is like so adorable. Here is a close-up. The sun is shining right on her there guys. So she has no marks or scuffs or whatever. Then her hair is in really good condition. Of course it'll need like you know a wash and all that but yeah. She came in her red top that says sassy on it in like this silver glitter as you can see here. And it has this kind of like silver dots going around the top. Then she came in her jeans with her silver glitter bell and then some silver like you know design at the bottom which is also glittery as well okay so um the next doll i bought was um uh yeah she's another brat's big babies i know I know guys, but um, I am obsessed at the moment. Like I am on a Bratz Big Babies kick. Like I can't stop. I am on that hype. So I bought her for six pounds fifty. This is the Bratz Big Babies Bath Time Blitz Chloe. She came in her original um swimsuit with both of her ponytails, which is like a rare thing when you get Bratz Big Babies or Bratz Babies in general. She came with more Bratz Big Babies clothes, and I was like, I can. 
do with that girl, like, I'm not gonna complain about that. So I got yet another Pretty in Punk, like, set. So I got the leather jacket and the skirt dress dress. This doll I am about to show you is one that is quite special to me for multiple reasons, okay? She is a character I have wanted in my collection for a long time, like a very long time. And the second reason she is special to me is because she was a gift from my boyfriend for Valentine's Day, okay? Now, no, I do not have a time traveling machine. I just got her early, okay? She is the Bratz Big Babies Felicia. It feels surreal to me to have her in my collection because I never thought I would get a Felicia. Here is a close-up look. Now, she was £20, which I thought was an absolute steal. Now, she does have some cut hair, unfortunately, up here and then up here as well. But um, at the end of the day, I don't care. Like, I genuinely don't care at all because I just wanted her. Her skin tone is is gorgeous. Like, she is absolutely stunning. I will show you my next group of dolls, which are normal size Bratz dolls that I got from eBay. Now, I bought two bundles that cost me £15 each, which came to £30 in total. So, they were pretty expensive, and I got six dolls per bundle. So, that is 12 in total. And, um, they are gorgeous, beautiful dolls, though, in excellent condition. So, I was okay with it. No shoes or clothes, so don't expect that. And I will show you them right right now, so I hope you are excited. Okay, so diving right in, I have the first doll, and this one is the Bratz Play Sports Ice Skating Chloe. Now, she is one of my favourites, hands down, from the bundle. Like, I am in love with her. Like, she is just so, like, fierce and, like, on point. Her makeup is beat, 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 beat to the gods, girl. Like, she has had her mug painted. This is how ice skating Chloe looks and her eye makeup blows me away like I am blown away by it genuinely. Then I got the Bratz costume party party princess Chloe and she is so oh my god like I keep saying the same words I need a new like dictionary but oh my god this one is like you know a fan favorite as well I feel like a lot of people love this doll because of good reasons I think but um yeah she is one of my favorites as well like this hair is insane girl gonna need a bit of like you know a flat iron and a fix up my mom is obsessed with her hair but I don't know why she's like oh my god like if that was my doll I would never straighten her hair I'm like why it's like an absolute bird's nest I don't understand it this is the costume party Chloe then I got another fabulous costume party doll and this one is the party pretty party pirate pretty party pirate pretty party pirate. What kind of English is that? Okay, so no, this is the Bratz costume party pretty pirate Yasmin. That makes a lot more sense and is a lot more correct, okay? So this is her now. Wow. All I can say is wow. I'm not going to use any other words because what's the point? You guys know what I'm going to say. Is that not everything? Is that not everything and more, guys? Like, Wow, I'm just, I'm just speechless. I love her dark eye makeup with the peach lips, like, oh, wow. <laughs> I can't say nothing else, like, wow. The next doll makes me really happy because I have completed another line. So yes to me, give me a clap guys. Like, I can hear you, I know, thank you. So I completed my treasures line because I do have Chloe, Yasmin, Sasha, Jade, and now Roxy. So here she is, and she is my final one to complete my treasures line. Now, of course, not all of them have their original outfits, which, you know, I'm a bit annoyed about, but I can make work, okay? so. So this is one of the lesser exciting ones, but um, basically only because I have her now three times, so I wasn't like over the moon to get another one, but however, nonetheless, she is still gorgeous. Funk out Yasmin in all of her glory, looking absolutely breathtaking with that forehead, giving you forehead for weeks, days, and years, girl. Now, these two dolls are the main reason, well, not the main one, but kind of like the main reason I bought the bundles, because I was like, oh my god. God. Like, I could not believe I found them because they gave me, like, that extra kick up the ASS to do it because at first I was like, um, I might buy them, I might not, like, £30, a bit expensive, like, on the fence kind of thing. Then I looked at them and I thought, like, what am I doing? 
what am I doing? Like, am I all right? Do I need my temperature checking? Because like, why am I not buying these bundles straight away? Drum roll, guys. You know the drill by now. The two dolls I got are the Bratz Magic Hair Grow and Cut Chloe and Yasmin. Now, I was so speechless and so over the moon to get these dolls. And to you guys, you might be like, like, you know, like, like. Like, like, I overuse that word too much. You guys might be like, they're no big deal, like, what are you so excited about? But to me, they were like a big, big deal. They are a big deal to me because I think they're so gorgeous. And like, I think that's what makes collecting so personal because we all have our own kind of like, you know, dolls that we love more or dolls that we want more or cherish more than another collector. And that is a part of being like, you know, different. Everything in life has different aspects. And even in collecting, that still counts. Here we have Chloe. Oh my lord. Like, oh my lord. This is makeup, by the way. But look at her. She is so pretty. Like, I'm done. I need to leave now because I'm done. Then we have Yasmin, and I do have Yasmin's um, dress, so that is great to know. Oh my god. Guys, I can't say enough positive things about these two dolls. So anyway, I got the Ash Champions Dana. This one is my second one in my collection. There you go, guys. So there is a close-up. She's gorgeous, guys. Like, I love her to pieces. Then I got this Chloe, who is the Bratz Pampered Pup Salon Style Chloe. And she's, again, another favourite of mine because of her face. Being beat to the gods again, guys. Like, I love Chloe with, like, dark eye makeup and, like, really nudie pink lips. Like, it slays me. Like, my wig is snatched. My edges are, like, messed up, girl. Like, I love her. So this one is the Salon Style Pampered Pups Chloe. That face. I'm sorry, but you can't deny the beauty of it. And if you do, then I'm willing to argue. Like, I am willing to argue with you because this girl, the hair is gorgeous as well. Like, oh my God, guys. I am so happy in this video and I hope it conveys through the camera because my love for the brats and like my passion is so strong. I know some of you guys get fed up that I talk a lot about my dolls, but I love them. So why wouldn't I talk about them? Like, we're a doll channel and well, I'm not a main doll channel because I do makeup as well and like other things, but you know what I mean? Like I heavily focus on dolls, so... Now, this one is another one I do have already in my collection. She is the Twins Krista, and um, from the Twins Krista and Leela, I do have two sets of them now. She is gorgeous, guys. Like, oh my god. There you go. There is Krista in all of her absolute beauty for you. Like, I'm done again. Like, I keep saying I'm done. Like I said, I need a new, like... Um, what's it called? Dictionary. Has anyone got one? I got another, like, you know, sister. She is from the triplets, the UK, you know, exclusives. And I got another Bridget. Now, I do have a full set. Look at these, like, snap tens. Like, look at those. I need to work on them. But yeah, she's gorgeous. Like, I love her to pieces. Glad to have another one. Then this one goes by, like, two names. So she could either be banging, um, bowling or blazing bowling. So I'm not sure. You can call her what you one, I'll call uh, Blazing Bowling because I feel like they use Blazing more. But um, however, this is her and she is beautiful as well. This is a Megan, if I did not mention. I probably did, but yeah. So here is a close-up look. Now, I'm happy to have her because all my other ones are in terrible condition and this one is an excellent, like, look at her hair. What was that? What did you say? Look at her hair. That was supposed to be. Okay. Now, it might be a bit late to address the elephant in the room because you guys probably clocked it about, you know, half an hour ago when the video started. But, um, however, I am going to address it now because that is what I was always going to do because it's part of the haul. Okay, shut up and just say it. Okie dokie. So behind me, you guys can see this Bratz photo, which is actually a bedding set on my wardrobe. Shock horror, I know. Like, can you guys believe that? Arts and crafty, you know. So anyway, one of my old neighbours who I used to live across the way from said to me a while ago that her daughter used to be into brats and I was instantly like okay does she have any dolls I can buy but um she said they were unsavable and went in the bin and I was sad because I didn't see them and see if I could fix them but oh well what can you do guys like I'm not being ungrateful because I love this and she said I do have a bedding set though and I was like is it a double she said no I was like fine whatever um so I thought I could make it mo uh, make it move I was like 
like, yeah, um, I can use it for my wardrobe and I use this on my pillow that I sleep on. I am so grateful to have got given that for free and um, I love it. And there you go. That was my Bratz haul for this video. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a lovely comment. Don't forget to click the notification bell to be notified when I upload and subscribe to see more from me in the future. That is, of course, if you want to, no pressure whatsoever. So if you don't want to, then that is fine as well. Don't worry about it. And um, I want to mention that I have created a Bratz Facebook group called Bratz Collectors or Capitals. I will put it down here on the screen and I would love to have you over there on my group because we have a really nice atmosphere, a lovely group of people. And um, yeah, I wanted a positive place to talk about dolls, Bratz dolls and like, you know, share our passion. So please come on over and join us. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. I love you all and stay positive. Bye.